Hey love bugs, it's Roslyn back at you one more again. I hope everybody is being blessed today. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, welcome, namaste. Love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are yet to come for you. And if you have not already, please like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And if you feel like you resonate with my video, please give me a thumbs up, like, and even share. And if you feel like you're comfortable enough, drop me a line or two. I love to get the positive feedback and it will greatly be appreciated. And thank you so much for coming by my channel and seeing about my video today. And for my returning subs, what's up fam? Love and light, namaste, love and blessings, and many blessings are yet to come for you. And thank you so much for the love and support. Today I'm listening to relaxing music for stress relief, calm music for meditation, healing, therapy, sleep, spa, and yoga. I was doing a meditation before I started this, and I mean, it, it got me into my emotions, like it, was, it felt really beautiful. So if you like to uh, meditate and you know, you really feel like you need to, this is a really good, like... It is just like really soothing. It's just really relaxing. It's like when you come to my page, I always try to make sure I got some music that either have you jamming or you're dancing around while you're listening to me or you just meditate while you're just listening. You know, because you might need to listen to that today. You know, anything that, you know, you just come across is never by accident or coincidence. Remember that. But my video is about Twin Flame 101. Uh, hey, because I got a new Facebook group page set up. It's a closed group where, you know, you have to, uh, you can go ahead and submit, you, you know, you want to join or whatever, and I go ahead and prove it. You're able to put links on there. We can have discussions. Uh, you can put videos, pictures up, you know, anything that, you know, you want to talk about as a Hayoka. You know, it's very closed off. There will be no judgment. I, I don't, I already put on in the description link there will be no drama tolerated so everybody will be respectful don't judge anybody about what they put down you know I, I, I just don't judge anybody I just try to give as best guidance and advice as I possibly can because I you know my past ain't clean itself so um it's just basically for people to be able to you know because not everybody you know does YouTube too much so you know, well, if they do, you know, they might not know anything about the Hayokas or the empaths or anything or, you know, that they have a group page out because I didn't see too many. Um, basically, I have seen one page, I think, that actually had something to do with Hayokas and it's called A Spiritual Journey. I'm going to go ahead and um, type it up in the bottom. So if you, I'm going to try to see if I can find a link to it on my page i'm trying to see how i can figure out to do that but if i'm if i can't put the link down in there i'll go ahead and type it in there so if you have facebook you can look me up and you know just feel free to go ahead you know give your comments or what you might want to talk about today or you know you want to hit me up and you know leave me a message or something like that you want to get in touch with me that's 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 fine also it'll greatly be appreciated but it's just basically you know, like on here, you know, a lot of people uh, go ahead and comment and, you know, tell me about what they went through this week. And I just love when, you know, you come up and you're open enough to, you know, you feel comfortable with me to go ahead and share your experiences. Like I said, I don't judge anyone. I try to go ahead and respond to everybody's comments. You know, if there's something negative or, you know, you're talking at me, I don't respond to those or automatically delete it. Um, and it's just like right now, I just feel like I'm on a new path. It's like things have opened up for me. I'm getting so much clarity. You know, I'm going through different emotions. So I'm like, you know, it's just like I really didn't want to talk to people on the phone. I'm getting these headaches. But I noticed it's, not, it's just not the real headaches. It's like my third eye is like opening and it needed me to see a lot of things that I wasn't paying attention to before when it came to people or things around me and my surroundings. So, you know, it's just like I'm on a spiritual path and I really want to get this done to where, you know, I'm able to be a motivational speaker, you know, helping people out on their spiritual journey, you know, because there's so many of us that need that extra help, you know, that need that positive energy, have more people on our level that can relate to what we're going through. Because it's like, you go through anxiety and depression and you're already got empathy issues, because <laughs> basically empathy issues, you're going through these 
these these, these different obstacles on you know dealing with other people's energy filling out other people's frequency trying to block it out you know and not take on other people's problems because we, we have a bad habit of doing that we'll take on other people's problems real quick and not even deal with our own and it's just like you know, I'm trying to get everybody to the forefront while I'm doing it myself, you know, helping myself heal, getting through the pain and the past trauma, you know, not trying to spew that off into my children so my children have children and going through the same thing. So, you know, I'm just trying to, you know, send as much love and light as possible, give the people that peace and understanding of understanding themselves, getting to know themselves more, you know, knowing that they can get through whatever they needed to get through, you know, despite... The fact if you're a Hayoka or a regular empath or indigo or any kind of star seed or crystal or a rainbow child or shadow child, whatever you want to call it, um, and just know that you're going to be okay. You know, you're really going to be okay. And we go through things on a daily basis, but it's just, it, when we go through things and it's really tough, it just does go, we have to go through that to strengthen us because. You know, obviously there's something really big that we're supposed to do if we got to go through so much hell. And I figured that, you know, because it's just like when you go through a lot of stuff, there's a blessing. There's always a silver lining at the end of that rainbow. And you have to remember that, you know, no matter what you're going through. And it's just you have to be able to see that. You have to be able to believe that. Push that out to the energy, you know, the energy out to the universe. You know, don't push out anything negative because we don't have a bad habit of like, oh, I'm not going to ever get out of this situation or, oh, I'm not this is not going to ever come for me or am I going to ever fall in love where I feel like I'm going to be out there by myself forever you know you don't you don't ever put stuff like that out to the universe say I am going to make it out of this I am going to get that business or I am going to get this degree or I'm not going to sit up here and be by myself forever you know I'm going to find that person that loves me for me and accepts me for me you know you just you know it, it, it's just I'm opening up to everything you know and I just feel like wow <laughs> you know, I'm all over the place, so forgive me if I'm acting, like, all out of there, but it's just, like, I feel really good that I'm opening up myself and, you know, not worried about what people think or what people perceive of me, you know, there's so much more out there than worrying about what people say, because, you know, people are always going to have their opinions about you, whether you're doing something good or bad, they're always going to have something negative to say about you, so, at least they'll have something good to talk about when it comes to me about this. <laughs> so I'm not trying to hold you up today. Go ahead and drop me a line or two. It would be greatly appreciated. And go ahead and like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you know when I upload my next video. And I will see you later. I will keep you in my prayers and you definitely uh, keep me in yours. And I will see you on my next video. Much love, light, and namaste. Peace and be wild.